Hi, my name is Lavish Kumar. In this video, we will talk about group products or, or in other words, product with variants in Knob Commerce. For this tutorial, we are using version 3.80. So group products or product with variants is a convenient tool to sell a product that has different supplementary items or different attribute sets. Different combination of such products can be sold as separate products and the price may vary. So in Knob Commerce, group products looks like a single product detail page displaying all possible options. It is convenient and very much SEO search engine optimization friendly tool to sell complex products. So you know just to uh, give you an example, let's say if you are planning to sell a camera, you might want to offer camera in color A or color B and prices may vary you know depending on the color so you might want to charge a uh, camera in color black fifty dollars more than color gray so you can actually create a main product as camera and then add variants as camera color a camera color b with different prices so you know just to uh, give you a better idea of what group products are in op commerce let's um, go to the administration section and let's add a new product we'll go to catalog and products so let's add a new product which will be our main product that will hold different variants so in this case we have to make sure this is really important the product template is selected to group products with variants because we will be adding more variants to this product and product type is also grouped product with variants so I'm going to create a main product let's say let's say books short description goes here here we can talk about the book okay so I'm just going to keep it simple. Let's save here. Okay. All right, so we have a product called group books here. Since I have added as group product, you will see that I do not get an option to add pricing because we will be adding pricing to the variance. So right now I'm just going to and here we are going to just add a image here just so that uh, you can understand what we are trying to do here in terms of group products. So just going to save it here and after saving I'm just going to back to the product list and let's add the variants now. So in the variant, I will keep it product type simple and product template simple as well. So here, let's say book type A or type, yeah. Short description goes here. Just going to select here quickly. And now, since it's a simple product type, I can add pricing. So let's say $10. So download a product, and I'm going to save and continue. And just so that it's very clear, I'm just going to add a picture here. Save and continue. Now I'm just going back to the product list and adding a new product, which is another variant. So it'll be it'll helpful uh, for you to understand how the variants show up. Book book type B. E. Just going to copy here quickly. And the 
pricing let's set up to $25 okay save and continue and I'm going to quickly add a image add picture okay so now I'm just going to look for the product that I just added which was my group product which is you can see right here I'm going to edit it and within this product I'm going to add the associated products which are also called variants so add a new associated product and I'm going to simply search for group A uh, book type A and book type B save okay save and continue and quickly I just want to point out that there's a feature called visible individually this if you this feature if you uncheck it basically if somebody's searching for book type A let's for for an instance um, this product won't show up individually it will always show up it, this option will always make sure that it always show up with the main product which is a grouped product which is books that we added so I'm just going to save it and I'm going going to do the same thing for book type B as well going edit now and visible individually I just saved it okay so now let's go to the public store and search for the product book here is our product as you can see it doesn't give the exact product basically it's telling us that the there are different variants in this product and the lowest variant starts from ten dollars it can it might be there might be number of variants that might be priced differently but it starts from ten dollars so I'm going to click on this book and you can see here there's no add to cart button on the main product so there are different options here book type A and book type B with different pricing so you know if you're for an instance if you're adding a camera for example you can put a camera body here and kind of put different color options you can put a t-shirt here put different options let's say you want to sell a t-shirt so you can put t-shirt as a main cap um, your product and you can put uh, cotton t-shirt synthetic t-shirts any other different materials as variants too so this is how we add group products with variants in knob commerce now it's time for for us to wrap up this tutorial video hope this was helpful this video is brought to you by Knopf Commerce, open source shopping cart. Thank you. Mm -hmm.